We're taking a live look outside on our sky cam at Jacksonville International Airport. Everything is a lot calmer compared to this morning. Passengers were held for hours. News for Jack's reporter Marilyn Parker explains authorities got a report of a device on board a plane. An overnight flight no one expected. I think it was something that had to be taken seriously. Delta Flight 1223 stopped in its tracks after a report of a device on board. At 11.30 p.m. Friday, the plane left Atlanta. 12.20 a.m. Saturday, the FAA called Jacksonville International Airport, reporting a device somewhere on the plane. Ten minutes later, the flight lands at JAX. On board was David Smith, who says they sat on the runway for a while. I looked out the window and tell we're not on the regular runway. We were on the furthermost runway that the airport has. JAX Director of External Affairs Michael Stewart says landing the plane away from the airport was the protocol given the security conditions. We're told the pilot first told passengers there was a maintenance issue. A woman whose daughter was on the plane says later they were told that wasn't the case. They came back out an hour later and stated, okay, it's a credible threat that on the plane and they are not allowing any of the passengers to get off of the plane. Multiple units arrived, including JSO's bomb squad and a K-9 unit from Jacksonville Aviation. They did a sweep of the planes and checked bags. Passengers were screened. Nothing was found. Around 3.30 a.m., we're told they started letting people off the plane row by row. I bet that was a big relief for you. Well, no, it was a relief when they let us go. Smith says they sat in customs for another hour. The FBI was also called to investigate as they do potential criminal acts that happen in the air. The investigation is ongoing. Operations return to normal here at JAX. You can see folks in line at the kiosks grabbing their tickets and putting up their luggage. And over here, you can see the status of the flights coming and leaving out of here. Most of them are on time. No cancellations that we can see. At JAX, Marilyn Parker, Channel 4, The Local Station.